Hey everybody, I just thought I'd bring something up to everybody's attention. Um, a lot of movies re uh, have been coming out recently where they're based off something, based off a comic, based off a book, based off a toy line, Transformers is a good example, and too many people, way too many people go there and go there hoping to see exactly what they is based off of it. Um, Transformers is an example. As soon as we heard a Transformers movie, I will, and including myself, Everybody thought of the head, you know, popped in the head, you know, off of crime and all that. Um, and when they, especially when they said it was D1 inspired, so we instantly started falling through our head. Optimus Prime, Bone Beast, Soundwave, Starscream, Megatron, you know, as their original G1 selves. So when, so when the first designs came out, we were all outraged about it. But then, me being the person I am, I, you know, I took a step back and I went, wait, 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 this might be fun. We just gotta find out how they're gonna make this work. When they start showing all the transformations and how, how on how we're just, when, when they start showing the transformations, I'm showing how every single bolt, nut, and plate of the car fitted somewhere on the robot, that's when the robot design started, you know, started to come together. The whole point is, is that, People out there, the people who are watching this right now, and say, um, there's a Street Fighter Friday movie coming out. And I know exactly what's going to go on. People, Street Fighter fans are going to go nuts. They're going to go there expecting to see what they saw off the, um, the cartoons. I don't know if there's a manga or not. The video games. And some of them will actually be quite upset about it. Because it's not exactly as it was when they, when they first fell in love with it. So my point is to you guys, if a movie comes out that's based off something, keep an open mind. Especially if it's off of books. Because I have heard, especially for the Harry Potter is a good example. It's a very good example. When people go there, complain it's not exactly like the book. But just please, go to those movies with a very, very open mind. You uh, And try to look from it as a standpoint as, and try, here's, a, uh, here's a good thing. Look at it as a standpoint where it's not from your standpoint where you loved it for some years. Look at it from standpoint of somebody like Joe, like John Doe who's sitting right next to you, who never even heard of it until two minutes ago when he decided to buy the ticket for the movie. Take it from that standpoint, and you'll enjoy the movie a lot better than sitting there judging every single minute, every single second, every single detail of the movie. Sit there, enjoy it with an open mind, and you'll swear you'll love the movie. I love Transformers. The Aragon movies were okay. The Harry Potter movies are okay. I like them. I sit there with an open mind going, okay, this is cool. Point is, when movies like that come out, sit there with an open mind and please just enjoy the movie and stop bitching about it.